Hello and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl JVB. How are you guys doing today? First and foremost, as always, thank you so much for being here on my channel, checking out my reaction videos and my own music, I hope. And if you haven't yet, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, the like button, notification bell, and you can pet my little dog right here. His name is Balti. He's my little superstar and my little friend. He's been with me for a long time and we've traveled quite a few cities, countries, towns, states, <laughs> quite a bit. Anyway, my name is Jacqueline Van Beek. I'm a singer, songwriter, music producer and composer, vocal performance coach, and I love doing reaction videos for you guys. So, a new band in town on this channel. The name of the band is Bull Who. It's such the band. No, maybe the name of the song is Bull Who, such the band. Um, featuring Haidia Hashmi um, and it's from the Nescafe Basement season 5 2019. This came highly recommended from some of you and I have never heard of the band. I don't even know. I just know that they, um, it says, take the spiritual journey of Bolhu with us and let it surprise you. An original by Soch featuring eight-year-old Haidia. Oh, eight-year-old, okay. Well, who is a soul-searching trance of belief and devotion, braving the test of time as it has within it the strength of the universe? Ooh, okay. That sounds pretty freaking exciting. So with no further ado, let's get to it. Yeah, I love teas, but I also love coffee, usually in the morning. It's kind of late at night. And this is one of my Halloween cups. And just because Halloween is over doesn't mean I can't use my cups anymore because they're just freaking cool. Come on. All right. So cheers to that. It's not Nescafe. It's Death Wish Coffee, which is one of my favorite coffees. This channel is sponsored by Death Wish Coffee. I wish. <laughs> okay. Anyway, let's go. Bolhu, such the band featuring Hydea. Hush me. Nescafe Basement, Season 5. Jack Neto Parega. I love the instrumentation. Rang ja, apne hi rang tu. Okay, so the singer. Oh, I love that so much. This is so to me. It's it's just like this world music sound in his voice that is so spiritual right away. I can feel that energy. Love that. And then also like the way the song slowly builds and the whole like background, the whole setup of the Nest Cafe basement is so freaking cool. I love that. The vibe is so cool. And I love how all the instruments start playing like one after the other. And the sound is really like something else. Love it. Basement, season five. Jack Neto Parega. Let's start over again. I love that. Rang ja, apne hi rang tu. Ho ja, apne hi sang tu. Guitar right there does it for me. Rang ja, apne hi rang tu. Ho ja, apne hi sang tu. Bana le choti si dunia. Bolu, 
I so love this music. It is so intense and spiritual to me. Like, I just want to, oh my God, it's so uplifting. You know, I don't even have to, I mean, I'm reading the words, but I don't even have to read the words to feel the energy of this song. It's gorgeous. And his voice, it sounds so familiar to me. Yes, it's it's a it just again it takes me like I feel like I'm on vacation right now I'm like somewhere in Indonesia like it's like this beautiful sound and all the beautiful instruments the way they blend together and the little percussion that starts it's just like the stop and go it creates this amazing like great like tension suspense and release it it's it's beautiful. I want to go back a little bit back right here. It's just, I love the, the instruments and how everything kind of like, oh, it's, just, it's so perfect. It's really, really perfect. so amazing the little stops they add like such great like dynamics in the song and and add to the like tension release and building up the chorus again which is like so amazing again his voice there's something in his voice i feel like when i go you know to ugh, i don't want to sound like ignorant but I, if i go to like an indian restaurant or like in in you know like just like in exotic restaurant like place and I hear this kind of music I'm always like oh my god I just want to dance you know I just want to have uh, it feels like I'm entering a different realm uh, a different universe that I really am not so familiar with but when I hear it I feel I am part of it like I don't I don't know, I don't know if that makes sense but it's very deep it's very beautiful this voice is so beautiful the melody is so beautiful and I love in Western music, we have a standard, obviously, you know, scale. But in other countries, like there's like India, for example, and Indonesia, like it has different, it's it's a different scale. And he's singing those scales and has something about it that is just like so, oh, oh, it's so special. And I think it's probably more for our ears because as, as a, like, Growing up in a Western civilization, I feel like we are used to a specific sound. So when we hear that, we go like, whoa. And I think it's either some people will not like it or someone like me is going to be like, whoa, what is this? Like, I want to explore this more. You know, it's so gorgeous. Um, I love it. I love the song structure, the song writing. And I love, love, love his voice. And just like the whole vibe is like so beautiful. And I can see now the description. So I'm going to go back to here. Oh, 
फिर लू सज दे This is a little girl, young little girl, with an old, wise soul. So much passion, so much soul, so much, oh my God. When she started, ah, and her mouth really opening and the sounds flying out of her mouth so effortlessly. You know, I'm always amazed why how kids, but I, I, I know I'm not amazed. It is amazing, but I'm not amazed because I remember when I was a kid, I would sing all these love songs. And as a kid, I think it's because we are so pure and we are so, and that there's just like this, this innocence within that we can feel things even though we may not understand exactly why, but we can feel things and internalize things. And for those who have talent, that's why there is those kids that can sing, you know, and belt it out and just like, they just got it because they're so plugged in. They are, they've been here before. And I mean, like, oh my, God, we have to watch this again. This might be a longer video, but come on. And you know what I thought when I saw it perform? This is going to be like a little Indonesian Bjork or an Aurora, like an artiste. She, she seems like to be really connected, really plugged in and Wow, I did not expect that. I mean, I expect I knew that there was a little girl singing, but I didn't expect that. Oh, my blowing. So much control. So much soul. Most importantly, what a performer at that age. She's not even trying. I 
mouth is hardly open. Honestly, guys, I am just blown away. That little girl, Hadia, Hadia, her expression on her face, and when she opened her mouth, her voice so powerful. When she was belting it and she was on key, she was totally on pitch. She was elongating those notes. Her, her, she was sustaining those notes. She was holding those notes like effortless. Like how can a kid that young have so much control over her voice? Very rare. And not only that, but her stage presence. She was like, she looks like she's been on stage for like 20 years. <laughs> Unbelievable. Wow, wow, I'm blown away. Love the band. I love the musicianship. The songwriting is like, it's it, it's just so hooky, so deep and meaningful, the lyrics. And like I said, the melodies are just so enchanting. They're so mesmerizing. They are so hypnotic. 
beautiful and like it's so deep i can see now like the spirituality within that song and within the voices and even the instrumentation so magical this was super magical oh my god so here comes my question guys should we continue with this band and Hydea, what is she doing now should we like explore what she's doing because she's got to have a youtube channel or something right i never heard them her but i'm blown away and i want to do more so in the comments below let me know what should be more what should be next and also what did you think of this and why is my dog looking all like missing his head there it is <laughs> he's not missing his head bolt bolty bolt what did you think Wait, you didn't hear anything because I had headphones on. Never mind. Keep sleeping. <laughs> Keep being cute. So, amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching, for being here with me, sharing this experience with me. Absolutely amazing. Like I said, I always want to leave you with something positive and uplifting. Make every day a great day. And oh my God, the power of music, whatever songs make you feel good, lift you up, listen to them whenever you're not feeling 100% because music is magical, musical, 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 <laughs> music is medicine. Honestly, that's just the way it is. And also speaking of that, make sure that you check out my merch below. I have it available and you may want to get it before the holiday season starts. So yes, you're not late. Um, but that's it guys. I love you guys so much. I'm going to talk to you in the next video and I look forward to your comments to see what you think and what should be the next song from this band and possibly from this amazing little superstar that just blew my mind. So I'm going to let you go. If you haven't yet, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, the like button, the notification bell so you never miss a post of mine. And I will see you in the next one. Take care.